So it's been a while and I'm not sending this to disturb you or whatever. I know that you have your life now and plans and no I'm not sending this to disturb you or whatever. It's just I'm wondering you you know we we, we made those plans together. So it's not like I want to disrupt them or whatever, but I'm just wondering because I've been, I've been trying to reach you and there's been no way. I went to your house today and your mother said they couldn't let me in. There was a function at your house. I told her I could come and cook for her. Come and send the table and wash plates. You know, I used to wash plates a lot for her. You remember now? <laughs> she, she called me a very agile girl that would make a very good wife for you. <laughs> so your mother had those jokes. And she would, you know, pack all those plates for me and function will be going on in the parlor and I'll be behind doing all those, you know, chores so that we have. Well, she, used to, she used to say I'm very good for you, we'll make a good team because that was our plan even before you showed me to her. So, I don't get why she wouldn't let me in today. Why she, I don't, why she wouldn't let me just wash plates for her all over again if that's what it would take. I don't mind. You know, I don't mind. I can be that very good girl for her all over again. I don't mind anything just for her to let me, for me to be able to reach you if it's through her. I don't mind. I'll do anything. It's not like it's a, a surprise or anything. I don't understand. Maybe if I sit with her a bit, she could. Let me understand the new plans that you guys have made, you know, without me. But then, she would let me in. It's a function. <laughs> a function that is now needless of my services that I rent out without asking for much. I needed to see your love. Your love was enough. Your love has always been enough. So why now? Why am I not being let in? What is going on? Can people tell me? Can you tell me? You told me we're going to 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 prepare a place for both of us and then we'll come back and we'll be together and like you know start doing our plans and you know checking those lists you know those uh the, the check boxes and you know putting the dots the eyes and the crosses to the t's but what's going on i've not heard from you in a long long time you're not picking my calls you're not replying anything how do i know you will reply this I even met Bio. Bio that I said I would not talk to again because of that thing he said about me, about how desperate I was, and about how you wouldn't think of me in the slightest heartbeat if you could help it. You know, I stopped talking to him. But Bio has been your best friend, so I had no choice. I had to go back to the same Bio and talk to him and ask about you. See, I've been so worried about you. I had to calm down. Download that desperation that Bayo has been talking about just so I could ask about you. Would anybody care for you? You may have cared for you. Not just you, your family. Your friends. I cooked your meals every week. In my busy schedules. 
I brought them to your house, did your laundry, did your mother's market rounds, did everything for her guests. But Baya would not speak to me just like your mother wouldn't let me in. And just like you are not picking my calls. So, so what do we do? What happens to our plans? Where do we go from here? I just want you to tell me. This is not how we planned it. It's not at all. So who is checking those boxes with you? Who is doing those lists with you? Who is ensuring you live the way you said you would live when we get together in that other side? Who is doing these things? If I'm not with you, and you are not feeling me in, or what's going on? So, <laughs> so, so, who is who is ensuring that you're okay? Is ensuring that your mom is okay and your friends are okay if I'm not there, if I'm not the one doing these things. Who is ensuring that you're even alive? Who else can do this thing if not me? If not been, if not been communicate, it's been months now. So I'm just wondering. Again, I don't mean to intrude on your schedule or whatever, but I'm just wondering. No, no, I don't hold it against you. I just want you to see this. Just, just call me or something. Just, just let me know that you're okay. Let me know that you're breathing. And if, if you're gracious enough, just let me know. Why are you know me talking to me? Is it me? Have I done something wrong? Just tell me. You don't even have to form my process to get to you. I'll, 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 I'll sort it out myself. Just let me know what's going on. Give me an address. I promise I'll get to you within the next week. I don't even need a month. I don't need a month. Within weeks, I'm with you. You know I'll do anything for you. Don't go. I'll process the visa. I'll get my passport. I'll, I'll find my ticket. Just, just let me know what's going on. Let this get to you. And just, just let me know. Just let me know. Please, nobody's talking to me. Let me just know what's going on. Please. Just let me know. <laughs> no, no, I'm, I'm not crying or whatever. I'm just, you know, just so happy at least I get to send this and I'm sure you'll see how much I love you as I've always loved you and I'm sure you can get back to me this time around. I'm so sure. If I, you even call your mother and ask her why she didn't live into a house and call by you and you know blast him for everything especially for not talking to me when I asked about you <laughs> I know I know this do what it's supposed to do I know it will I can't wait I can't wait to hear from you <laughs> I know I need to be good mm. so I can't wait for your reply <laughs> No, my love always. <laughs> <laughs> mm.